Once upon a time, in a distant land, there lived a monster in the middle of the desert. Interestingly, it could only feed on fresh soil, newly sprouted plants, and seeds. Not far from the desert, there was a kingdom yet undiscovered by the monster, where the king and queen were saddened by the fact that they had no children. One night, unable to sleep, the queen sneaked out of the palace and wandered around the desert. The desert monster noticed her, but did not approach or harm her because all it desired was to consume all the plants and fresh soil in the world. At that moment, a shooting star streaked across the sky, leaving a trail of emerald green. The queen, upon seeing the falling star, made a wish. Oh, I wish for a daughter whom I can embrace and raise with love. Suddenly, a star fairy appeared before the queen, saying, Dear queen, I heard your wish, and I have come to fulfill it. If you want a child, wander the desert for seven days and seven nights. The magic of the stars will bring you a surprise. The queen followed the star fairy's instructions, and on the seventh day in the desert, just when she was losing hope, she heard a distant crying. Walking towards the sound, she discovered a tiny baby crying on the sand. She immediately picked up the baby and returned to the palace. The king, thinking the queen had disappeared, was overjoyed to see her return safely. The happiness was further enhanced by the adorable baby in her arms. They named the baby Earth Princess. Years passed, and the Earth Princess grew into a beautiful girl. Her favorite activity since childhood was playing with sand. When she drew a butterfly in the sand, real butterflies would materialize and flutter around her. If she drew a flower, it would transform into a real, fragrant blossom. Only the king noticed her magical powers, but kept it a secret to protect her. One day, as the kingdom celebrated the bountiful harvest, the desert monster caught a whiff of a distinct scent. Recognizing it as the fresh aroma of soil, it couldn't resist and swiftly moved toward the source. The ground tremors alarmed the king and queen, who, upon reaching the palace balcony, witnessed the monster approaching their kingdom from afar. The king exclaimed, This cannot be! I thought it was just a legend! He immediately ordered the soldiers to stop the monster, but its size and intimidation caused most to doubt their ability to defeat it. The monster seized the soldiers and threw them into the desert, causing panic among the people who began fleeing to save their lives. The monster continued devouring every plant and seed in its path. In the midst of despair, the king rushed outside with the earth princess following. He pleaded, Princess, my beautiful daughter, stay with your mother in the palace. I don't want any harm to befall you. However, the determined princess responded, No, father, you know I can defeat it. I can save our kingdom and lands. Reluctantly, the king left her and charged toward the monster with his sword. Despite his efforts, he couldn't stop the monster, which was about to grab him and throw him into the desert. Unable to bear it any longer, the Earth Princess drew a shield in the sand, and magically, it transformed into a real shield. She ran towards the monster, creating a massive bucket in the sand, which also transformed into reality. With the magical bucket, the princess lifted and hurled it at the monster, trapping its head inside. Now, the monster couldn't see or devour the fertile soil. Seizing the opportunity, the Earth Princess concentrated and created a sand tornado to carry the monster far away from the kingdom. Witnessing this, the people were both astonished and relieved. The Earth Princess, exhausted from using her magical powers, was embraced by her father. He thanked her for saving their lives and kingdom. From that day on, the Earth Princess, with her courage and magical abilities, protected the kingdom's lands forever. For without the Earth, there could be no life, and the Earth Princess knew this truth better than anyone, and they all lived happily ever after. If you liked our fairy tale, do not forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more fairy tales.